hi everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel so guys today in this video i'm gonna tell you how to fix keyboard freezes on iphone if your keyboard is freezing or unresponsive on your iphone it can be frustrating issue to deal with so guys here are some steps you can take to troubleshoot and potentially fix this issue first of all you have to force close the app if the keyboard is freezing in a specific app try force closing that app and reopening it to force close the app, simply you have to first of all open the app, then swipe up from the bottom of your screen and to access to the app switcher, then swipe the app card up and off the screen. And if it is still doesn't work, then you have to do is restart your iPhone. A simple restart can often resolve minor issues. Go to your settings, tap on general, scroll down and then tap on shutdown, shut down your iPhone. And then restart it after 15 to 20 seconds later. If restarting doesn't work, then you have to do is update your iOS version. Ensure that your iPhone is running the latest version of iOS. Software update can include bug fixes and improvement with keyboard. So you have to go to your general, scroll up, and then go to software update and check if there is any available update for your iPhone. If there is, then simply update your iPhone to the latest version of iOS. If you're updating to the latest version of iOS and you're still facing the issue, then you have to do is Clear the keyboard catch. You have to go to your settings, go to general, scroll down, and then tap on transfer or reset iPhone, tap on reset, tap on reset keyboard dictionary, enter your passcode and try to fix your issue. If it also doesn't work and you're still facing the issue again and again, then you have to check for software updates in the problematic app. If the keyboard freezing issue occurs in a specific app, make sure that the app is updated to the latest version. App updates often include bug fixes like keyboard freezing and etc. After trying this all solution and you're still facing the issue again and again, then you have to do is reset all settings on your iPhone. Resetting all settings on your iPhone can sometimes resolve software related issues without erasing your data. To do this simply you have to go to your general, scroll down and then tap on transfer or reset iPhone, tap on reset, tap on reset all settings in a passcode and fix your issue. So guys if this video helps you then make sure to like and subscribe my youtube channel for upcoming videos and thanks for watching.